Magnum double rolling timing chain set. Alright guys, it took me a minute to get this lined up about right. As you see, this, this part's going to go in the back. That's your uh, basically your spacer. I kept trying to put it this way and I was like, what the hell? The cam kept moving back and forth. Kept reading the instructions. Apparently I have comprehension problems. Um, your timing marks, O, O, or the dot, whatever you want to call it, are supposed to be lined up. Let's see if I can get this to, to go on. Don't look like it. I don't know what the hell the issue is. Um, and it fellas that is it um, as you can see I've used a straight edge and doubled and tripled check this my timing mark there and there That's it for this video. Like I said, that was my first time and put, putting a cam in. And as you see, I'm sweating my ass off. And I don't have no, it's like an oven in here. And I don't have very much room to work with. Very small shop. But hopefully that's going to change in the next about year and a half or two. Um, but yeah, man, that's it. Hopefully I don't grenade this motor. Again, there's gonna be some things with the torque. I got installed a cam bolt. That's gonna be ARP. Just gonna go ahead and throw this out here. Pretty much every bolt I bought is ARP for this motor. I like ARP because you can reuse them, as most of y'all know. Head bolts, things like that, they stretch with the cooling and heating and the compression of these motors. You're not supposed to reuse them. ARPs you can. I'd rather go ahead and spend the money to have good stuff that I can reuse in case this motor ever gets tore back down um, and the thing that I told you y'all wasn't going to agree with this motor is a stock 302 has not been bored it has stock crank rods pistons bearings everything I've looked at everything and they look great there's no no coloring from ex extreme heat I mean they all look great so I didn't see the point in tearing it down rebuilding it when it don't need it you know why fix it if it ain't broke uh, when this motor does grenade then we'll talk about what we'll do then and it probably won't even be a stock block it'll be something like a DSS or man of war or something something to that to that effect damn I can't see anyway that's pretty much where we're at with that uh, the more stuff I get in the more stuff we're gonna do yes I am gonna uh, torque all the rest of the stuff except those two um, everything's gonna be torqued correct I bought a brand new cobalt torque wrench it was like a hundred bucks and uh, we're gonna make sure everything is just right I assure you anyway thanks for watching and have a great day